The 26th annual Great Scottish Run took place in Glasgow on Sunday in ideal running conditions for the some 20,000 plus competitors taking part. Bright and early the runners arrived in George Square for the start, with many taking the opportunity to do some last minute stretches and warm up routines. Competitors in the 10 kilometre race were first to set off at 9am, with many people dressed in costume and running to raise money for charity. As the minutes ticked down until the start of the half marathon, the butterflies began to jangle, with the runners bouncing around eager to get underway. Shortly before 10am, the wheelchair race began, and was quickly followed by the main event, with several elite runners jostling for position at the start. The 13 mile course sees runners exit George Square and make their way to the south of the city, where the route winds through Bella Houston and Pollock Parks, the new Garbles, and finally into Glasgow Green for the finish. One of the highlights of the race for competitors is passing over the Kingston Bridge, where runners get a rare opportunity to cross one of Scotland's busiest transport links. As the energy is sapped along the course, competitors find inspiration in the large crowds that line the route. And with such support, the last weary mile inside Glasgow Green is achieved. Whilst the elite runners can complete the half marathon in just over one hour, most of the runners are happy with just a personal best or even just making it round the course. Either way, despite their aching bodies, most are left with a huge sense of satisfaction and a large smile on their faces.